Hi guys, welcome back to another product review and today I'm doing a review of the Super Beaut Wonder Cream Super Fresh Day Cream and it's this one. Now this has a creamy texture. It comes with a pump which is very convenient and it is in a creamy texture. Once you blend it, once you blend it out, it feels um, watery, liquidy. And the thing with this is that it dries quite fast and once it dries up, it is very hard to build up. Just because, as it says on the packaging, it leaves a powdery veil. And you know what happens when you apply liquid uh, makeup or creamy makeup on top of powder. It is not a pretty sight and it streaks and totally removes uh, the first wipes away the first layer of um, this day cream so I would suggest that you apply as much as you want and you know just blend it out real fast it has a light powdery smell but nothing offensive it's quite bearable also I would not suggest um, tan girls to use this just because even for me even for my skin tone it can become it can look quite white um, a bit white a bit too white for my you know preference This product in my face right now as you've seen and I have set uh, with powder one half of my face this other half and then I left the other half bare I actually got this from Beauty M&L and when I first when I was ordering it online I thought that it was gonna be bigger than this so I was quite surprised to see that it's actually a little bit on the smaller side but I don't mind that since there is a lot, when you look at it closely, there is a lot of product inside. It has um, light coverage. It's, it has a light coverage, light to medium coverage. What I can say though is that it does not cover the under eye circle. So if you're looking for something that also covers the under eye circle, I would suggest the Milani foundation, um, two in one perfect uh, foundation. But this one, uh, it does not, really conceal your under eye circle especially if you have under eye circles like mine really dark hard to cover so i'll get back to you guys after five hours just to see how well it stayed on my face um, i apply this product at three o'clock p.m so i'll get back to you at 8 p.m i'll see you guys later bye hi guys so it is now 8 5 p.m and this is what um my face looks like now after five hours of having the uh, Super Beaut Wonder Day Cream on my face. Wonder Cream on my face. So as I've said, this is the side of my face that I've set with powder and this one, this side, I did, I just left it alone. And there it is. I don't know if you can tell the difference though. Hmm. But upon looking in the mirror, upon close up, uh, upon closer look, especially when I look in the mirror, this side looks more. Uh, this side looks better. Uh, it looks more put together than on this side. Now, if you're not going anywhere, um, if you're just going out to do some errands, to run some errands, it's enough that you just uh, put this on and not set it with powder. 
but if you want to look more put together more um, fresh I guess I would suggest that you set it with powder it still looks good although although I can I notice some oil on my face my face or my t-zone is getting a little bit oilier but not too oily it looks like I'm I have highlighter but I don't I will get back to you guys after um, four hours just to see if it still um, looks good after nine hours of having this product on my face hi guys so it is now it is now 1207 and I've had this um, I've had the Super Beaut Day Cream for more than a little more than nine hours now, and this is what it looks like. Again, this is the side that I set with um, powder, and this is the side that I left bare or alone. Upon closer look, upon closer inspection, I see no difference at all. Unlike earlier today, after five hours, this was. This side looked more put together and, I don't know, fresh. And I'm really oily on the T-zone. Okay, now so for my review, um, I like the day cream. It is good for when you're just going to run an errand outside. You can just uh, leave it bare, leave it as it is. No need to set up. No need to set it with powder, although it doesn't really cover the eye bags or dark circles. So you may want to add a concealer for that, which I'm sure you will do anyway. Um, again, this isn't really buildable just because once it sets, it becomes powdery. I suggest you use whatever, you, how, however much you're going to use and then just you know spread it all over your face and work fast. In blending it again it has a light powdery smell but it isn't offensive so that's okay that's all right it does last quite long but you may want to um, retouch with powder or blot your um, blot your face with an oil control oil control film thingy as for the price this is 200 I'm sure I'm pretty sure I bought this for 280 pesos but I will if if I'm wrong, I will correct myself and I will also put the link of this uh, product in the description box just so you know where I got this and for how much. So yeah, um, for its size, it is um, um, it is 30 grams. So it looks a little, when you, maybe when you first get this, it will look a little bit tiny for you. But if you look at it closely, there is a lot of product in there so i give this super beaut wonder cream super fresh day cream two thumbs up i like it i'm gonna keep using this so i hope um this video was very informative for you guys and if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe to my channel i'll see you guys in my next videos bye